Hey everyone, what is going on? And we have another showcase for you today, taking a look at the Eon Duo Latios and Latias in the Great League. So very cool, very spicy Pokemon. They are single moves, but that's totally fine. I mean, I don't have mine double moved, so no problem. They're both Shadow. In fact, this whole team is Shadow. We have Alolan Sandslash as well in the lead. So let's go ahead and see how these battles play out, see how this trainer does with the Eon Duo. I think they're called the Eon Duo, right? Latios and Latias. Um, so let's go ahead, yeah, we'll just jump into it. Uh, we're gonna see a Dragon Claw right now. That is gonna pick up the shield. I mean, that would KO the power of Latios and Latias. Uh, Shadow Latios and Latias. <laughs> really, really strong. So Avalanche is gonna be enough to KO. By the way, hopefully the whole intro we get Shadow Reggie Steel because I really want that. I don't think we will, but that's the topic for another day, I guess. Uh, but let's continue on with the showcase. We're gonna see an attack come in. Is it an Avalanche? Is it a Shadow Ball? It's gonna be an Avalanche. That is gonna be resisted. Still doing a decent amount for being resisted, but in comes Venusaur, and that is gonna be a good game. Very well played to both trainers. We are moving on. Um, oh, okay, this is a really good matchup. Even though you don't have Gyro Ball, you do resist every move. They do have Powder Snow. Um, so, is this a Dazzling Gleam? Did they charge up for Dazzling Gleam? Uh, no, it's just gonna be a Weather Ball. Totally fine. Sand Slash able to easily take that. We do see a switch into Chestnut, but out comes this Latias with Charm doing so much damage. So much damage. Even though it's non stab, it's still doing a lot of damage. Frenzy Plant almost KOs the Dragon type. In fact, that, they knocked each other out at the same time, and that's just because. Latios and Latias, the Shadow variant is going to be really, really frail, right? Sand Slash coming in. Uh, we are going to see this attack right now, and it's going to be a Bulldoze, uh, and that Bulldoze will connect. Very nice. Uh, and trying to get to another attack, trying to get to another attack. Able to get to an Ice Punch. Uh, so Ice Punch is resisted, but we'll see how much it does. Um, and okay, that is going to pick up the shield. Um, you, okay, gonna go ahead and shield, I guess Dazzling Gleam would do a lot to a Shadow Alolan Sand Slash, and it is Dazzling Gleam, that might have actually KO'd, even though it's resisted. We're gonna see a Shadow Claw farm down, very nice, uh, and in comes Noctowl, Noctowl is weak to Ice Punch, and this Sand Slash already has two Ice Punches ready to go, so we're gonna see one come out right now, of course, the Shadow Claw is gonna be double resisted, but we're gonna see another Ice Punch come out right now. Uh, and this Ice Punch is going to connect. One more will get the job done. Uh, just going to let it go, though. Sky Attack might KO. Um, if it doesn't, they can Wing Attack down. It actually doesn't KO. But in comes, yeah, in comes Latios. And Latios will be able to finish things off. Going to go ahead and get to this Dragon Claw. And this Dragon Claw is going to KO. Could have fallen down as well. Doesn't really matter. And that is going to be a GG's. Very well played to both trainers. Let's go ahead and jump right into the next battle. We do have a Lolan Sand Slash into Reggie Steel. Okay, so you're definitely going to get KO'd from a Focus Blast. Bulldoze, I, I guess, will do a lot. But I don't think a one shot. Well, maybe. I mean, you have to shield. Even if they Zap Cat and Bait, uh, you still have to shield. Uh, and Zap Cannon does take more energy to get to, but it would be a bait because you expect the shield and you're going for that debuff. Uh, but nonetheless, uh, that's not what they did. You still have to shield that, of course. And we do see a shield there. Trying to get to another one. No, trying to catch. Oh, able to catch? Okay. Well, regardless of Focus Blast or Zap Cannon, they're both resisted and it is Focus Blast. That is resisted, but look how much damage <laughs> it still did. Uh, we're going to see this uh, Sand Slash come out. Sand Slash is going to go ahead and go for the Ice Punch. Uh, Ice Punch should pick up the KO easy, as it does. Uh, so in comes Reggie Steel. Okay, they did throw an attack, so this uh, Sand Slash is actually going to go ahead and bait. Okay, kind of a risky bait, but if it pays off, it pays off. And it does pay off. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Uh, so you're definitely going to go ahead and shield this for sure, right? Uh, this would easily KO the Sand Slash, as we know. Form up a little bit, watch out for a potential catch. Uh, and gonna go ahead and go for this bulldoze at this range just easily chaos the Reggie steel uh, No doubt about it and Reggie steel does go down uh, and in come. Oh my gosh It's a grass type charging up charging up charging up going for the ice punch right now Can the sand slash get to another ice punch? I do think you live a frenzy. Well, you probably don't live a frenzy plant to be honest um, Yeah, I imagine you actually don't live a frenzy plant at this range and it is frenzy plant. Yeah, the KOs but it shouldn't matter because this is going to be, this Latias is going to be able to charm down. And that is going to be a great game, very well played to both trainers. We're moving on. Ooh, okay, going up against this uh, Bastion Don. Okay, you are taking a lot, you are taking a lot from SmackDown. So they might be able to two shield and farm down if they choose to. But Bulldoze is coming out and it's going to hit like a truck, probably enough to KO. Actually, it's not enough to KO. It, all, it does do a lot though. 
Uh, so we're gonna see a shield right now. Can you shadow claw this down? I don't know. Um, oh, they switch into a razor leaf user. So is this double razor leaf? It might be, but this sand slash is gonna be able to fund that. I mean, both of the Pokemon in the back are resisting razor leaf. So if it is Victor Bell, that's totally fine. Uh, they do go ahead and shield it, but this sand slash does have another ice punch coming out, and, and this should be enough to knock out. But they do actually commit the shield. And out comes this uh, Dragon Breath user trying to farm down. No, going to go ahead and click on the Dragon Claw. This is to ensure that they don't get off an attack where you have the shield. Makes sense. Um, so Bastiodon coming in, but should be able to. Yeah, able to farm down. Is it Victor Bell? No, it's not Victor Bell. It's actually a Toxic Rogue. So going to go ahead and uh, charge up and go for this Dragon Claw right now. This Dragon Claw is going to do so much damage, almost enough to KO. Uh, and yeah, one more Dragon Breath will pick up the knockout. So much damage with Latios and Latias. Good game. Let's go ahead and move into the next battle. I like the Noibat hat, by the way. Um, I have it as well, I'm just saying. Okay, going up against Lantern, okay? You do have Bulldoze, but we're gonna see a switch out into this uh, Latios and gonna go ahead and go for this Dragon Claw. Very nice. Going for this Dragon Claw. Uh, will they shield it up? They do shield it up. I mean, they. You know, even if you're not sure what move Latios and Latias have, you know it's going to do a lot of damage because it's Shadow Latios and Latias. <laughs> They're going to go ahead and go for an attack. Thunderbolt is going to be resisted, but is it resisted? Look how much damage that did, right? So technically resisted, but really, I don't know. But going to go ahead and shield up that Surf. Go for the farm down, come on. Oh, can't get it. I guess you should have thrown the Dragon Club, but that's okay. I mean, you do get farm on Sand Slash, but unfortunately they have Scrafty in the back. Oh man, having that Charm Latias would have been amazing. Oh my gosh. So definitely going to go ahead and switch out after this. Um, and they're staying in, but they do switch out into a Star Raptor. Wow, talk about Spice. It is a Gust version. I think if they get to an attack, which they do, you shield and just take this game. Um, yeah, definitely going to go ahead and shield. You're going to be able to Charm down. Close combat, you're going to be able to Charm down even faster now. Um, and they do get off an attack. Foul play will KO easy. Ooh, actually it will definitely KO. How low is that Sand Slash? Can you Shadow Claw down? Oh, you can't Shadow Claw down. That was actually super close. Good game, well played. Let's move on to the next one. Sand Slash into Swampert. Okay, um, gonna go ahead and switch out. They're gonna go ahead and switch as well into Aurorus. Ooh, okay, cool. Uh, so Aurorus, obviously you lure off the Ice type, which is good with one of these Dragon types. Um, so Dragon Claw is gonna connect. Um, do you shield and go for the farm down? Oh, they don't even throw. Okay, beautiful. That's it. That worked out well. <laughs> um, so in comes Swamp. and gonna go ahead and go for the Dragon Claw right now. They, they could have thrown the Weather Ball, but maybe they were trying to? I don't know. Uh, but in comes Latias right now. Latias... Okay, Sludge, Sludge Wave will hit like a truck. It's gonna be Hydro. That would still do a lot. Um, they're gonna be able to get to another one. No, they're not. Never mind. What's in the back? Is it weak to Charm? It is weak to Charm. And you are resisting counter as well. Uh, they're going to be able to throw an attack. Going to go ahead and shield. The Charms are doing so much damage. I know a lot of trainers are not fans of Charm users. But at the same time, this is a unique Charm pick, right? Let's go ahead and move into the next one. So, Sand Slash into Skarmory. Okay, you do resist the attacks. This is uh, looking pretty good here. You definitely stay in. Uh, they go ahead and switch. And now out comes the Charm user. You love to see it. Um... Okay, so what is that? Thunder Punch? Ice Punch, maybe? Uh, it does have Ice Punch, so good shield there. That would have done a lot. So able to farm down. So even though Skarmory will come in, it's still going to take a lot of damage. <laughs> well, uh, maybe not too much. But it will have to shield this Thunder. Because, I mean, unless they think it's a Dragon Claw. But, I mean, it does. I mean, it has Thunder, so. Uh, so... Oh my gosh, they don't shield it. They're calling a Dragon move, maybe. And in comes Altaria. Oh my gosh, that is amazing. Uh, okay, bringing in Sand Slash, you do resist the attacks from Altaria as well. Gonna go ahead and go for the Ice Punch right now. And this Ice Punch is going to pick up that shield. Uh, gonna go ahead and make an attempted catch. Not able to catch, but that is okay. Uh, Moonblast will KO. Sky Attack actually probably KOs, but just gonna let it go. Sacrificing it. I think it's worth the sacrifice there. Uh, Sand Slash is probably the way to win. Um, are we gonna see... No, we're gonna see a farm down. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and shield this. I think Skarmory does have an attack, which is a little scary because Brave Bird will KO. Um, but I don't think they have Brave Bird. Oh, they, they quit. Okay, good game. Let's move on to the next battle. Alolan Sand Slash into Umbreon. Okay, okay, okay. Very cool. Um, they do resist um, 
the shadow claws, I guess, but still, uh, we're going to see this Ice Punch come out. They're going to be able to throw in, uh, an attack, either going to be a Dark Pulse or a Foul Play, probably a Foul Play. Uh, no, it's actually going to be that Dark Pulse. One more Dark Pulse will KO, but we do see a switch into the Charm user. Uh, and they're, they're slow to swap out, and they do bring in a Bash Deal Don, which is kind of unfortunate. Um, but we do see a Thunder, which is neutral. I doubt they shield this. Bash Deal Don can take almost any hit. <laughs> and, uh, they don't shield. That does... For being a Bash Deal Don, that did a pretty good amount of damage. I don't know if that Bash Deal Don is XL'd or not, but even if it's not... Um, okay, so... This is going to be pretty rough, I think. We're going to see the oh, Latios coming in. Latios is going to be hit with an attack right now. Going to go ahead and let it go. Stone Edge will do a lot of damage. Almost enough to KO it. Um, oh, they're able to fall down before the Dragon Claw. Uh, I, I, I think this is going to be a loss here, but we'll see. We'll see. Uh, we're going to see this uh, shield, of course. It's the Stone Edge that would have KO'd. Uh, farm it down, and you gotta go for the farm down, but look how low you got. You do have a lot of energy, but they have two shields, and plus they have another Pokemon in the bag, so uh, the opponent should be able to win this one, but we'll see. Gonna stick it out, I, I respect that. We'll see what's in the back. Gonna go ahead and go for another Ice Punch, pick up another shield, pick up the... I mean, it could be really weak to Ice in the back. Uh, they actually let that go. Metachamp, never mind. Oh, <laughs> they have Metachamp. Uh, that's gonna be a good game, well played. Let's move on to the next one, Alolan Sandslash into Mandibuzz. Okay, um... Pretty decent. Uh, the only thing is uh, they do resist your Shadow Claws. Ooh, Toxicroak coming in. Out comes the Charm user. Um, Sludge Bomb probably KO, so you, you do have to shield it. They're, they're taking neutral damage from Charm, right? Um, and going to be able to farm down very nice. Look how low that Latias got, though. Um, but that's okay. Uh, we're going to see... Ooh, Umbreon coming in. They don't want to take this Charm damage. Uh, I don't know, maybe unaware that it was Charm? I don't know, but either way, uh, we're going to see this Thunder come in, and they do go ahead and shield and get off an attack. This is going to KO, so just going to let it go. Could, in theory, shield that, but uh, and just get a bunch more Charms through, but uh, I don't think it's necessary, although it would have gotten a lot of Charm damage. Uh, but they're going to be able to go for another attack. going to go ahead and let this go. This is going to do a lot. Uh, in fact, it actually KOs. Uh, so maybe it was the the play to go ahead and shield that charm Latias. I don't know, but we'll see this Ice Punch come out right now. Uh, and Ice Punch will pick up the shield. They're going to be able to go for an attack. Uh, just going to let it go. It's it's going to get the Sand Slash relatively low. Um, and Mandibuzz coming in. Um, there's two two Ice Punches KO this Mandibuzz. We'll see. We'll see. I'm actually not sure. Oh, no. It looks like it doesn't. And oh, hmm. This is tough. They do throw an attack, you do have to shield it because it does KO, but um, we'll see. Uh, gonna go ahead and, and shield that Dark Pulse, and going to farm, continue to farm. Two Ice Punches now will KO, but um, I don't know if you get it off. Oh, you gotta farm it down, I like that play. Look how low you are. You, this Ice Punch needs to KO, if it doesn't KO, you lose. Um, let's see if it KOs. How low is that Umbreon? Oh, it does KO. It was low enough. Probably just low enough. Wow, well played. Let's move on to the next one. Sand Slash and the Metachamp. Terrible matchup, but you do have two answers to it. So we're going to go ahead and go into Latios. And they do bring in Bash Yodan. So we do see another Bash Yodan from the opponent. So we're going to go ahead and go for this Dragon Claw. I doubt we'll see any shields. Um, and yeah, no shield makes sense. Uh, they're just going to farm down. Uh, which is actually really unfortunate, but that's what Bash Dildon is good at doing, right? Uh, farming down. Uh, so Dragon Claw is going to connect. I mean, it does get it relatively low, but you're still going to lose this matchup. Um, and in comes Sand Slash. Sand Slash is going to go ahead and respect the Flamethrower. Flamethrower is double super effective, um, and you certainly don't want to take it. Um, going to go ahead and go for the Ice Punch. This doesn't KO, but probably hoping that you could farm down afterwards before they get to a flamethrower, but they actually do shield. Okay, they do switch into Metachamp. Ooh, out comes the Charm user now. Um, gonna go ahead and shield. I guess you are weak to Ice Punch, so gonna go ahead and shield that. It is a Psychic. Um, gonna farm down. What is in the back besides that Bash shield on? I guess we'll see. Sableye? Oh, Mandibuzz, they're bringing in Mandibuzz, but they are weak to Mandibuzz, but if they get to one attack, it. it We'll probably KO uh, the Latias, but we're going to see this Thunder come out, and that is enough to KO. Oh my gosh, they do throw an attack, and I think you, you win. You win, because you can get to an attack, you can get to a Bulldoze. 
Um, what an ice punch even, but just gonna go for the bulldoze. Or go for the fawn down. Oh yeah, they hit, they have a shield. Yeah, going for the fawn down was the way to go. And that is gonna be a great submission. Thank you so much for sharing your battle experiences with us. And I'll see you all in the next one. Have a good day. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.